This is just a quick explanation of how I do an overlay comparison when the two clips are uh, shot from the same exact same angle using a tripod. Um, the bottom clip in this case is the dominant overlay. Let me blank out this one. It's very sluggish, unfortunately, when you start doing this. There we go. And what I've done, oops, So I go into Mask and Chroma, and this is my visibility, and I set it to about 55% or, or transparency, I should say. I set it to about 55, 56%, and then I go into Chroma, which is color correction, and I just set it to 100% red and that seems to work for the color clothes I'm wearing and the color dog I'm running. And let's go back here. We'll make this one apparent. As I say, it's very sluggish when you start messing with the transparency and the chroma. And go to project. And voila, the background is is rendered black for some reason. I don't pretend to understand why, but um, as you can see, there's just a bit of color difference between the two clips so that you can make a nice comparison. And it's going to vary a little bit from photo editor to photo editor, but the basic um, steps are the same. You prepare your overlays you take the clips you want and you put them into the overlay or picture-in-picture -picture tra uh, tracks, whatever it's called in your uh, video editor. You take the transparency of the top track, which in the case of Corel Video Studio is always on the is always the bottommost track, and you adjust that to, as I say. 50, start with 50%. I found 56 works better. And then you adjust the uh, the, the chroma or uh, what did they call it? Uh, go back here. It's an edit. Color correction. And I just color corrected it all the way to red. Hope that helps.